Hey guys, it's Gorani to here, and it's that time once again to be prestiging in Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. So here we are ladies and gentlemen once again as you can see in the top right I'm prestige 5 level 50 you guys know the drill so let's first off get into the classes so first one here pretty standard Val 27 uh, with the full grip and quick draw grip uh, also running lightweight and danger close running fast hands toughness and blast press the usual kind of stuff exo overclock and two frags I'm really liking the danger close and frag setups now I've been using that quite a lot since uh, I kind of like saw the pro players using that in the COD champs which is a little while ago and uh, yeah I I've been liking it ever since it usually gets me a few kills you know just spam them across the map and uh, yeah usually works out pretty good now the ASM1 I've been using this a lot this prestige a lot more than the battle apps actually this prestige which is uh, you know I, I usually use the battle mostly uh, but no I've been using the a lot of the ASM1 so running the magnitude variant which has two better range for one less handling and one less mobility really good variant uh, in case you don't have like the speakeasy or anything like that still waiting to get one of them in my supply drops I'm sure uh, I will do guys eventually in one of my supply openings of course which you guys will see with my live reactions hey if you're new to the channel haven't seen my supply openings go check them out there'll be a link to the place down in the description open supply drop lives and it's a lot of fun so yeah same perks and stuff like that I'm actually running exo ping on that one uh, which is good for like team deathmatch and stuff seeing people through walls is uh, you know never too too shabby rocking my mp11 goliath class here with the foregrip uh, this is actually a new one because i recently got the mp11 goliath variant and it's actually really nice three better damage for three less handling really good trade-off uh same perks and stuff like that as you can see don't really run any score streaks on these uh because you know the score streaks aren't that good in this game and you might as well just uh kind of load up on perks and uh stuff like that speaking of score streaks uh there's actually pick 10 now in black ops 3 it's been co confirmed to be that rather than pick 13 because you're going to have to have score streaks so that you can't do this and just absolutely overload on perks and become like some massive undefeatable for the most part juggernaut so uh, hey if you want some black of three information once again links in the description guys giving these shout outs to my own videos hell yes video promotion on youtube i'm getting the hang of this thing i think anyway ak12 lance class uh same kind of stuff there once again just go over these nice and quickly HBR3 average Joe, love the average Joe variant, uh, really good. Still don't have that insanity. There we go. Might as well go over my super fun class, guys. You've seen this if you've seen my Kevin Spacey the Pirate game, where uh, I had a lot of fun doing that Photoshop. But anyway, yeah, I played some uh, Exo Grapple gameplay. Really good for Exo Grapple. You can kill a lot of people with this thing. I actually go top of the team most times in Exo Grapple, which is pretty nuts. Even though this is just like a messing around class, definitely recommend it if you guys just want to mess about and aren't trying to play too seriously in the Exo Grapple player. It's got my own class there. Don't really use that too much for a few supply drop challenges. Uh, and then these uh, these are just you know odds and end classes. Onto the stats, I believe. So combat record, as you can see, Katie's still going down, still going down the hill. Not quite as fast anymore. Just realized the Prestige Six emblem that looks really nice with uh, the drag and kind of looking thing behind the shield and uh, is that gun barrels sticking out from behind the shield? Something like that. I don't know. I like the blonde there. Nice uh, little sh kind of silvery blue shine to it. Uh, so yeah, KD ratio 1.6 uh, with a win-loss ratio of 1.03. So that's gone up quite a bit. Been playing a lot of gun game and stuff like that. Timing combat, 2 days, 15 hours, 9 minutes and 49 seconds. 11,054 kills, 8,807 deaths, 355 wins uh, with uh, plenty of score, 343 score per minute, 16.7 seven percent accuracy uh, which is actually increasing which is really good i think i'm finally getting the hand of my accuracy i don't know i think i figured it out that i was basically pressing down on like the uh sticks too hard which uh would like make me crouch sometimes when i wouldn't want to or actually I've, i'm set to tactical so it'd make me knife something wait no no, it is crouch. Yeah, tactical is crouch. If you have it on default, then it's knife. Uh, but yeah, I think I've kind of solved that problem now. So my accuracy is going up. And 705 games played. Got a few uh, personal best medals on the right there, which you guys can have a look at if you're interested. Game modes, uh, that's kind of recently, you know, uh, around the 1 to 1.5 KD re ratio. Uh, favorite weapon, Bal, never really going to beat that. Kind of catching up with the SM1. But then again, 4,000 to 1,500. Yeah, that's going to take quite a while to top that. Anyway, Exofrag and uh, Stun next on the list. Uh, UAV, 400. Uh, yeah, I don't really use kill streaks, you can see, or score streaks in this game. Medals and stuff like that. So, yeah, guys, that's pretty much it for stats. Anyway, 
what we got armory, of course, before I go into the prestige redemption. So, yeah, as you, as you can see, guys, since the last one, my supply drop luck has gotten great, okay? Uh, of course, typical, okay? Once the new Call of Duty gets released and once we're getting closer to the release of the new Call of Duty and this game slowly kind of dying out as uh, we move on to the new one, I start getting the good stuff when it doesn't matter as much. But anyway, guys, I'm still appreciative of the Sedgehammer Games Gods for finally giving me some decent gear and stuff like that. So anyway, Atlas Engineer, Exo, Atlas Orbital, Helmet, Crossbow, Conqueror, EM1, Polar, Vortex, K5, Spanner, Kraken Exo, that's what, what I'm rocking at the moment. That is a really nice, cool looking Exo. I really like that one. Happy with that when I got that in the supply drop. KVA Radical Pants, that's also what I'm rocking, as well as the uh, mask and the gloves uh, and the shin guards. Actually, got almost got a full set. I just need the loadout and uh, Exo suit, even though I wouldn't rock it because I like this Kraken one too much. Uh, got the Moors Ignition and the Mayhem Ball. Then they don't really change anything, just uh, the camos. Got the MK14 Eagle Eye, MP11 Goliath, the NA45 Ravenger, Psychedelic Helmet, another nice helmet which makes you stick out like a sore thumb, but oh well, it's all about the swag in Advanced Warfare, guys. We got the Nigerian Command Loadout, Nigerian Armored Exo, Sack 3, Blood and Glory. Still haven't tested them out, they seem pretty shit, so probably not going to, not gonna lie. Sentinel Operator Pants, and of course some white out boots, and a white out shirt actually, uh, which uh, I think uh, I, I might be rocking that now actually, I think, and the boots. Uh, so yeah, and I'll just quickly go through these guys. You can just see, uh, you can do a little comparison to your armory and see how bad my luck is still is compared to yours. But anyway, guys, on to the prestige, prestigiousness, the prestigeness. I don't know, prestige mode. Read all this globbery gloop before. Anyway, time to choose opponent on luck. You guys know I have to think about this shit. So yeah, back in a bit. Alright guys, I decided I'm going to go with Exo Ping. There isn't really anything else too worthwhile I can uh, kind of find. I went through everything. Couldn't really see anything else. Uh, no guns that I really wanted or anything like that. So let's unlock Exo Ping. Rank 33, you get it out. So I'd say that's a pretty good choice. Anyway guys, last chance. No going back. Let's enter Prestige 6. There we go. Level 1. Prestige 6, level 1. Guys, be sure to join me back when I do another uh, another prestige video you know in another like 50 levels time we should hit that subscribe button and of course we did just get another advanced supply drop there along with uh four other supply drops so hell yes people definitely subscribe for that supply opening as well once again all the links to everything that i mentioned uh you know kind of near the start of this video the supply openings and uh black three information all that kind of stuff open it up see what takes your fancy thank you so much for watching and i'll see you guys next time bring back some blood and gore as you can see my favorite clip from the reveal trailer is where uh the guy shoots the crossbow sticks the guy goes flying up in the air and then just fireworks of lungs and limbs and blood and yeah it's just